As we check in on our cave in prehistoric times, it appears as though there's a domestic quarrel between these two bird-like dinosaurs. What could they be fighting over? Ah, it must be these dinosaur eggs they're fighting over. Super bonus question, pals. Put in the comments which of these bird-like dinosaurs do you think is the mommy and which do you think is the daddy? It appears as though one of the birds is looking up in the sky. Oh, and there's a huge predator above. A huge predator circling around, taking a look. Look how big this bird is. This is a Quetzalcoatlus. It's one of the biggest birds ever. Actually, the biggest bird to ever exist. He's looking for a free meal. Uh-oh. And what do we have here? It's a Carnotaurus. He must smell the eggs. Oh, he's taking a peek inside. He sees the eggs. Oh, he thinks he's going to get a nice free meal. Be careful. <laughs> Horus is really, really wants them eggs. Oh, look, one of the birds runs off. And I don't think that was a wise move. Uh-oh. Goes the Carnotaurus. He's relentless trying to get in. Trying to get in this small opening. If he only went around the other side. Oh look, one of the bird-like dinosaurs is fighting off, but the Carnotaurus seems to have got him beat down. Oh no, this is not gonna end well for the big eggs. Like that. So, oh, claws the Carnotaurus in the eye, and the Carnotaurus is stunned. Carnotaurus is disoriented and look, oh, what is he gonna do? Oh, he runs off. In the Quetzal coatless, oh, he's flying off with a free meal. Well, at least somebody's gonna eat today. Oh, looking back at the cave, the baby's finally hatched. It looks like we're gonna have another single family home, but that's okay. Everyone seems happy for now. Hi pals, it's Rich and I'm back and today I've got something I'm super excited about. It's the Schleich set, dinosaur set with cave. This is set number 42261. This is so cool. Oh, it's bubble wrap. Yay, bubble wrap. Oh, cool. This is like a nice piece. I think it's the top of the cave. Instructions. I know how to play with dinosaurs. All right, so we got a lot of the bags open and complete. Let's slap some of these pieces together. Look at this cave, this cave is awesome. So you just line up the tabs, put it right in there. Neat. So the next step is you put the top on the cave. You can see it's got nice little pegs that go right in there, nice and easy. And you got these two pieces of vegetation. And there's a left side and the right side. So pay attention. This is on the right side. Nice. Look at how realistic that is. That's crazy. Oh, look what's in here. Ah, it's a little baby dinosaur. Let's zoom in on this baby. Take a look at it. What does it look like? It looks like a baby T-Rex. Or maybe a Carnotaurus. Oh, look how soft he is. He's cool. All right, so we can stick him in one of these eggs, I guess he goes. And it comes with two of these eggs. So there he is, you put him in the egg, throw him in there, cool. He's a little baby pterosaur. And these are nice and rubbery. They're high quality figures, man. Schleich's got some good stuff. This is not cheap, it's museum quality. It's really nice. These are like, you know, top of the line toys. Put him in there too, bang. We got our eggs set up. All right, and then we've got this plant that we got to put together. Ba -da -da -da. And then there's a spot on the side. Recommended spot is right here. All right, cool. So now you got the plant on that side. You've got the vegetation, the vines coming down. You got some eggs up in there. All right, so let's open this one up. This one, cool. He looks like uh, an Archaeoteryx. So he looks great in this cave too. Archaeoteryx. He's sometimes referred to as the original or the first bird. It's a genus of bird-like dinosaurs. It's transitional between birds that fly and birds that didn't fly. 
So he looks really cool. I love the coloration on him. Again, real good quality. Check him out. Here he is. Check out our next one. He's another type of bird. So take a look, this guy here, he's really cool. He's got two pairs of wings. So he's a Chang Yu Raptor. Yes, he is an early relative of the Raptor. He looks like Guido in those uh, Land Before Times movies. And he's from the early Cretaceous period, about 125 million years ago. And he was found in, guess it? Yeah, China, with a name like Chang Yu Raptor, you would certainly think so. See, they look great in their environment here in this cave. Colorful, awesome, really cool figures. All right, so let's get on to some of the bigger ones that came with this set. Aha! Look at this. This is an awesome figure. Wow. And yes, this is a Carnotaurus. Wow, he's a good looking dinosaur. I mean, if there ever was a good looking dinosaur. But what detail, great work on this dinosaur. I mean, look at the head, the two horns coming out of it. Carnotaurus means meat eating bull. So you can tell it's a Carnotaurus because of why? The two horns on its head, and he kind of looks like a T Rex. His head, his snout isn't as long as a T Rex, it's more circular. But he looks like a meat-eating bull if I ever saw one. And you can see the spikes down his spine are really cool. It's made out of this nice soft rubber. It's like really nice quality. It's not hard rubber, so it's it, it just feels really good in your hand. And his mouth opens and closes. There he goes. Boom. And what happens with him really well, you can see the biggest thing with any dinosaur toy that really turns me off is that it doesn't stand. This stands great. Look at it. What's nice is with the nice soft rubber, it's not going to damage anything. You could bang him around and he's good, great quality. Gotta love it. This is a real nice dinosaur. Carnotaurus would definitely be on the hunt trying to eat something up in this cave. Give me that. So really cool, Carnotaurus. All right, cool. And the other big dinosaur in this set. Oh, check him out. He is awesome. And he is Quetzalcoatlus. And he is the world's biggest ever known flying creature of any type. Just insane how big he was. His wingspan was over 13 meters. That's almost like 40 feet that's crazy when you think how big that is look at the head on this guy huge his legs were huge this guy was crazy look at this coloration and, and it's a really nice flexible dinosaur so it's not very rigid and again it's made out of that same high quality material take a look at the detail of his face really really nice dinosaur and this being the world's largest flying dinosaur ever, it's great to have a high quality, real high quality dinosaur. I would trade 10 of my cheap dinosaurs for one of these, just for the simple reason that these are the top quality. You want the best stuff. I mean, having a bunch of dinosaurs is cool, but not like this. I mean, this is a real nice guy. So he also had a long neck and his head is actually very long, you can see here. And his legs were almost three meters in length themselves. So that's almost like three meters, a meter is about a yard, that's like nine feet long legs. I mean, this guy is crazy. Think about it. This is one crazy looking dinosaur. Imagine this coming flying around. I mean, you better hide up in there. Wah! So back in the prehistoric times, a cave was a great place to hatch eggs or to hide from predatory dinosaurs. And you know what? The big predatory dinosaurs knew that, so they would check the caves out and see if there was anything to eat in there. But if you had enough cover, you could successfully hatch an egg. But some of these dinosaurs are very hungry and they can still get in and get your babies. So really cool. Schleich, great job. We definitely like this set. 
We're gonna give it four and a half out of five stars just because it's super high quality. Almost took me to five, but not quite. Very hard to do. This dinosaur set with cave retails for $59.99. And I think it's well worth it. A high quality dinosaur alone is worth $25 to $30. So you get two really detailed high quality ones. You get two medium ones, you get two small ones, you get eggs and you get the cave. I think it's a pretty good deal. I'm pretty impressed. So comment on your favorite part of this set. Is it the Carnotaurus? Is it the cave itself? Or is it the baby eggs? I don't know. A lot of cool stuff. A lot of cool stuff, pal. Give us a thumbs up. Like the video. Share it with a friend. And subscribe for more cool videos of toy dinosaurs and other cool toys from Toy Pals TV. Thanks for watching, pals. And remember, don't be a Carnotaurus bully. Watch another video by clicking below. Watch the good dinosaur toys get slimed, or watch Jurassic World toys, Pteranodon vs. Helicopter. Or click the eye on the top right of the screen for more videos from Toy Pals TV.